Hello and welcome back to iFashion Network. This is our segment on emerging designers and today we're going one-on-one -on -one with the talented and emerging designer Miguel Antoine. Am I saying your last name right? Antoine, correct. Antoine. It sounds a little French, a little Spanish all at the same time. It does it, and it's with two N's, the Antoine part. Antoine. That's the, my American twist to it. Oh, okay. Put a little twist on it. Well, Miguel, thank you so much for having us in your showroom today and sharing with other emerging designers who's trying to make it in this crazy fashion world. So let's just start by asking you, where are you originally from and when did you graduate from FIT and how long have you been in business? I am originally from Florida. I moved to New York about seven years ago to attend FIT and I graduated just four years ago and I've been in business for myself for a little under a year now. When you were at FIT I've learned that you were designing women's wear. And now you're doing menswear, beautiful men's line. So tell us why you transitioned from one to the other and what that was like. Menswear, it just comes to me intuitively. My inspiration, it just falls into my lap and I'm able to uh, tap into that, you know, more so than I could in, in women's wear. And, and I just really want to be a part of that. Where do you think menswear needs to go and or where would you like to see it go? It's been very, very casual over the past, you know, I'd say seven to ten years. And I want to bring back that element of dress that's been missing in fashion. And it just, you know, really give, you know, inspire guys to put on clothes again and, you know, and dress the part. Dress up and look great in it and feel great. How are you going to be creative around this economic recession that we're in. I just have to be proactive and you know make certain changes and in, in, you know in, in the financials and just really you know watch everything that I'm doing to make sure that I'm, I'm making the right decisions and just really cutting back but also not sacrificing the quality and design that I stand behind 100%. What is your process? What is your what is your, how do you start? Do you start with start with sketches? Do you start with the fabrics? What is it that lifts you into the next collection? I walk down the street and I grab inspiration. It just it flows from different points and so I sit down and I have a conversation with myself and you know I start with some sketches um, you know black and white no no color whatsoever and I, I normally don't add color to my sketches at all um, because I think that once you add color to them it tends to move you away from um, your, your creative your creative ability uh, and so um, the black and whites and just you know just really just thinking about the consumer you know my customer and what he's looking for and um, from there I go into fabric selection and and I, I play with silhouettes I drape fabric and end up with a, a product. Well, you just stay right there because I'm going to pull something off the rack that I really gravitated to, and it's over here. <laughs> I actually saw this on his website first, and these are a pair of swim trunks. And i got to tell you, Miguel, the first thing that came to my mind was, guys, it doesn't matter if you're wet or dry, you're loaded with your pistol. <laughs> <laughs> I have to say, you're probably the first person that's gotten that. You know, when I designed it, you know, I was looking at it on paper, you know, it, it, I didn't grab that, but after the fact, I was like, wow, this is exactly what I was going for. And it's a, it's a, it's a great swimsuit. You know, this guy, I mean, the fabric, it's an advanced fabric I imported from Japan. You know, by the time it's a nylon, a cotton nylon, it's 70% cotton, which you just don't find cotton in swimsuits. Um, but by the time this guy get back, gets back to his towel, he will be 100% dry. That's just the innovation in this fabric. And it's a simplistic state. It makes a lot of noise. Then thank you so much. You're watching iFashion Network and our Emerging Designer segment.